For more than two hours this morning, police officers with rifles patrolled the perimeter of this apartment building on Vine Street in Springfield Township. It seemed like forever. Gary Couch says police came to the building because a man fired a gun inside after a long running and at times violent argument with a woman. All kinds of crazy stuff. And then you hear doo, 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 three shots and it's like we got to get out of here. The explosive sound of gunfire prompted one neighbor to call 911. Just like pop and then another one pop and then another one pop. I'm staying down in my apartment too because I don't want to get you know straight bullet come through the wall or something. Springfield Township Police Chief Rob Browder says the man who fired the gun is 54 year old Anthony Lofton. No one was hurt, including the woman in Lofton's apartment. She is not injured. The shots were not fired at her. She is fine. Browder says Lofton barricaded himself inside the building and engaged in a lengthy negotiation with officers before turning himself in. A scary incident. I didn't really know what to do, actually. This neighbor asked that we not show his face. He's glad the incident ended peacefully, but thinks this morning's chaos could have been worse if the weapon that police say Lofton used worked properly. Loud noises and uh, then a click, click, click from a weapon, then two shots, and then some more clicking and a third shot. It seemed like he had struggled with the gun, it had jammed, and there was a lot of clicking involved. Now, detectives are trying to determine a motive for this morning's shooting. Uh, Chief Browder said Lofton did not explain why he fired the gun after he was taken into custody. Reporting live tonight, downtown Todd Dykes, WWT News 5.